Hello everyone. Welcome to this short video talking about sensitivity analysis. So sensitivity analysis as explained before is just answering the question of or questions related to what if. What if one of the real data is not exact number, it's a range. What if it's not the right number? What if we decided to use a different uh, scoring technique or what if we decided to use our different weighting technique for the requirements. So let's start with uh, weighting techniques since we talked about this in the previous video. So we said that we talked about using two different weighting techniques for the requirements, the rank sum method and the uniform weighting sum method or the uh, weighting, the uniform weighting method or the equal weights method. So for the first option, we just used the rank sum and we got the weights for each one based on their ranks. For the other option or the other method, we just divided the 100, which is the total weight by the number of requirements. And just by doing this change of using two different weighting techniques, we find that the result became different and BMW was the lowest or the last option using the rank sum method where it's the first or equal to Kia on the first level or first options level using the uniform weighting technique. Okay, what if the price of Ford is uh, let's say 5,200 or 52,000, sorry. It's 52,000 instead of the previous number. So in this case, the score related to it should be changed. So instead of four, it should get three, right? So it's gonna fall in this range. So in this case, I'm gonna change the score of four from four to three. And just by clicking that, it's weighted score change and the total weighted score also changed. And we can see that already gonna be the same for this case. If we're just gonna put it three in here, the result changed or the total score changed, even though the final decision is the same. So by that we can make our conclusion, for example, if the price of the Ford increased from its original price, which was 26,000, I think, to up to 52,000 or up to 75,000, so the score will change from four to three, and that's not gonna affect our final decision for the alternatives. But what if the BMW price changed from this price to 99,000. So in this case, the score of this one changed from, or should be changed from one to two. And that's gonna increase the score here and make it better than Ford, if Ford price is 52,000. Let's see if we're going to use the uniform weighting method and make the BMW score 2 instead of 1. That, in fact, make it better than Kia if the price importance as a requirement is exactly the same as all the other ones. So in this case, with that change, the first option will be definitely BMW. The second one is Kia, the third one is Ford as the ranking of those alternatives. So this is how we can just play with the numbers based on the situations as a sensitivity analysis and see the impact on our created model. Thank you very much.